up guys, this is Joe Vieira, Presence of the Unknown Paranormal Activity Research Project in Santa Maria, California. And I just want to go over some of the gear that we use. Um, this is my setup. Most of the stuff here is from GoStop. And like I said, some of the stuff I bought at the dollar store. And, you know, you'd be surprised what you can get at the dollar store. I buy a lot of batteries from them. But sometimes, you know, you get what you pay for. The batteries don't last. And I have a bunch right there. But anyways, um, yeah, the batteries there are cheap. They're only a buck a package, but you can get what you pay for. They, they run out pretty quick, but I mean, they'll last you at least a couple hours. You, you want a decent amount of batteries, that's for sure. And it gets expensive when you're buying a lot. So let's move forward. Um, as you can see here, I got my spirit box. Every investigator has this. Um, then I have the speaker that connects to it. This is an external speaker I bought. Um, it's by Craig. It's real cheap. But it's loud and that's what you need for the spirit box and of course you got your knife uh, we carry these around just in case you never know <laughs> and then we have uh, a recorder this is really cool um, it records any um, voices uh, even whispers it picks up from a long distance so this is pretty cool to have Basically, I use this to measure, you know, see what the temperature is in the room. If it drops tremendously, then you know there's something going on. So I kind of keep this handy. I don't necessarily use it outside. I just use it in like enclosed areas like rooms and such. So this is pretty cool to have. It's a good temperature reader. This is my EMF. Um, this device is a, it um, picks up uh, electromagnetic fields. Uh, this is really handy to have. As you can see here, watch. I'll pick the speaker up. That's what it looks like if there's a presence there or something. So this is pretty cool to have. Get this at, at uh, GoStop.com. Really nice device. And then um, got my camcorder. This is a Sony. It's one of those pull-out deals. The screen folds out. I use this a lot, um, mainly in the daytime. You can get some uh, low light situations, but it doesn't have the uh, night vision. Now getting to the night vision, this is awesome. I just got this at GoStop, and the camera's a 4K camera. It's like typically like a GoPro. Um, this thing's awesome. And then I got my lights right here, my infrareds, and it's a full spectrum. I don't want to blind you guys, but I'll just put it to the side a little bit so you can see what it looks like. That's what it looks like, and it just lights up the whole room um, at nighttime when it's completely dark. So there's that. And then I have this. This is my uh, recorder. This is pretty cool. It's like a watch style from GoStop, again. Um, this is a, has a uh, speaker. It's got a microphone on it and you can record with it and I usually have this running at all times so this is pretty cool I'm turn this off but a lot of this stuff like I said is from GoStop um, this is really cool this is my GoPro and it got um, this light attached to it which I'll show you what it does lights up everything you got a SOS if you're in trouble um, it's really bright let you look at it from the side, I don't want to blind you. But that's what it looks like. It's got four modes in it. It's really cool to have. So I use this sometimes. Let's turn it off. Here's my GoPro kit. Um, I got a lot of attachments, they're all over the place here. Uh, Aaron got us these. This is a heavy duty flashlight. It's got um, regular mode. It's got the red, and it's got the blue LEDs. Look at that. That's awesome. Um, these are really good for in a room. Um, we usually use this mode for looking down hallways. And then I use this. This is a three-axis gimbal. I hooked this up to my cell phone. Uh, right now I'm using my cell phone, so. Because uh, the Samsung cameras on the S8 Plus phones are really good. That's why I got this. Um, it's uh, unbelievable. It's a three-axis motorized uh, stabilizer. 
it, it works really well so you don't get that shakiness when you're shooting um, and then I got different tripods for different situations this one unfolds and I got the clamp on style GoPro uh, camera um, attachment that clamps onto any object a table or whatnot you can place a camera in any anywhere in the room you just clamp this on a table or any type of surface that's hard and just basically clamp it on there let go and boom your camera's right on top right here and then I have this I use which is really cool this goes on your head it's a headband got the little attachment to, to put your camera right on there so you can wear it um, you know on a ball cap or something and that way you got both hands free so that's really cool to have because um, sometimes I like to use my flashlight too on top of the lighting on my camera and then I got these now these I got at the dollar store <laughs> these are cool man I mean you clip this on the collar of your shirt and you face you know kind of aim downwards like that and if you know it's typically good for uh, if you have uh, electronic device that doesn't have a backlight like this one for instance my recorder okay it doesn't really light up at night so you can't see this so that's why I have the, these things I just turn them on I can place one on the camera and aim it downwards and that way I can see and then you know, I can see everything what I'm doing so that's pretty cool I got three of these and they're only a buck at the dollar store and I got these at the dollar store these little pouches you can put your um, stuff in like these little devices over here like my, my EMF and then I got my recorder I can put that in one of these um, my spirit box I mean you can put them anything in here you know not anything but something about the size will fit right in here I got the medium size and I got the large size this is for my EMF because this thing right here is big and it's thick so I need that um, and then you get these other pouches from ghoststop.com uh, these are really cool slide so velcro they clip on your belt I got two of those sometimes I don't like using these I use those because it's easy really easy access and you got to have a pair of gloves of course got these um, and then I got this little flashlight to communicate with spirits now this thing it, 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 like if you run out of juice on your battery on your camera you plug plug your camera into this and it'll last for hours and hours and hours as long as this thing is fully charged and that, that happened last night to me when i was at the mission in san miguel my camera died in about an hour and 10 minutes so i used this i plugged it right into this and it lasted five six hours and this thing still has plenty of juice 29 bucks it's like 30 bucks with ta uh, plus tax but this thing is is really cool and you can plug two devices in it You've got two ports so pretty cool and it's got the got the power button on it too right there so that's where you charge it but it's really cool man gotta have that too but anyways guys um this is basically it and then um of course you gotta have tape we use red tape we put x's on the floor for hot spots that way we can go over there and you know kind of remember this is like a a tool to use so that way when we come back to that room if you see an X there we basically know it's a hot spot so we kind of mark all the hot spots with red tape put an X on the floor so this is good to have and then of course you got to have your book we take all our notes with this now I use this backpack out in the field for like uh, long trips and stuff and a lot of walking but if I'm doing a, like a short trip and it's a you know really uh, short session and I'll go ahead and use this. This is a really cool bag because I can put all my little gadgets in there. It's pretty cool. So, and then I got this tote. Everything fits right in here. And I got a lid that sits right on top. So that's basically it. That's all you need. I mean, typically you only need a, your cell phone. You can get away with just using your cell phone and a couple little gadgets like your recorder and spirit box, which the spirit box is like 60 bucks. And this thing was like, Shit, I got this thing for like $39 at Walmart. I mean, they have better ones, of course. Um, but, uh, I mean, you, you can get them basically anywhere. And the, the speaker, you got to have that. Because the speaker on here, it's not really loud. 
So, um, got to have an external speaker. But that's it, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. But this is typically what we use out on the field. And uh, we'll be, uh, well, I'm going to be posting up some videos for the team pretty soon from last night's uh, session at the um, San Miguel uh, Mission. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And don't forget to go to presenceoftheunknown.com. Thank you very much.